Hi, you Dictinistas. Clara here, Miss PSA. <laughs> Welcome to the channel. Oh, it's so nice to have you stop by and join me uh, on my latest uh, PSA. So thank you for hanging out with me. And thank you for uh, hanging out with me as I do this unbagging of luck. And uh, yeah, and I hope everyone is also doing well. So hope everyone is doing good. Uh, yeah, so like I said, this is a unbagging that I, I want to do. It's kind of been overdue, but some uh, uh, a lug bag that I actually picked up from uh, QVC. It was, this was a few weeks ago, or dare say the end of last month in August. Uh, yeah, so it was a QVC big deal uh, to uh, item of the day. And uh, yeah, and I had to pick it up because it's a new item for Lug. And uh, actually, the two things there are two things in here. And if you picked up that um, QVC big deal, then you know this is the, of course, the swivel and what it looks like and the uh, pouch that it came with it. And uh, yeah, so I need to do this. Uh, and I couldn't decide which one I wanted, so I ended up getting three of the same. Yep. Picked up three of the same, and I need to kind of figure out. Uh, I know I'm keeping one for sure, and possibly two. Not sure about the third. So either I'm going to keep all three, or I'm going to return uh, one, or maybe I'll sell um, one of them. But this one, as you can see, I opened it up because I had to make sure that at least the one I am keeping, the one that I wanted for sure, is the one I'm going to at least um, present in its entirety as a, a show. So let's dig in and let me just pull out the receipt. And yeah, so this is the Lug Convertible Medium Crossbody. It came with the pouch. You can get this on Lug's website. They sell it separately as of now. The Lug, uh, rather the the swivel purse, the crossbody, and the pouch are two separate items. But QVC, when they had it, they were selling it as as one um, one uh, item together. So that was really nice. So let's dig in, shall we, into this pretty swivel bag that I am like really eager to crack open and start using. So this um, actually, let's start off with the pouch. This is the uh, pouch that it came with. So these two items came as one of part of the uh, Today Special with QVC. And this is the pouch that is new to Lug. You can find this on Lug's website. You can still find it uh, on QVC, I believe, as well. And this is adorable. Now this pattern, I had to have this pattern. This is what drew me to this. Now, it looks very blue here, but it's sort of like a, well, they call it, let me just tell you what it's called, and then you can get a better perspective. It's called Tiles Teal. So it's like more of a teal, but yeah, it has the dark blue, but it has like a, maybe a slight undertone of a really light, light green. But you can see more of the blue, definitely. So yeah, so this is the heart pouch, and this is so adorable. Now it's made to... Uh, it comes with the clip so you can hang it off any of your uh, bags. It doesn't have to be just a swivel. You can hang this off any of your bags. Particularly, I would say backpacks would be a cute uh, feature to it. And uh, yeah, so it's adorable. Now it has, um, it is a zipper. And as you know, Lug makes the best zippers. Let me just, yeah, Lug makes the best zippers in the world. I just love it. And uh, again, there, oh, there goes my favorite feature of Lug. It's always their hardware. Their, their hardware is so cute. I call it my little teardrops. Anyway, so this um, pouch, when you open it up, has a zipper that goes all the way. Let me just show you. Back up. Back up a little. It goes all the way past the center. So if this is the center of the, of the pouch, it goes past the center. So um, notice they do not coin. They don't. Uh, refer to this as a coin pouch reason being if you go all the way to the end which you know obviously you can and when you open it up look how pretty it is inside this is the inside pattern to um, to this um, tiles teal so it's this really pretty pattern now it has this gusset 
that allows it, you know, obviously to expand and close. Now this gusset, if you open it all the way, you see my finger? Yep, all your coins will come rolling out of there um, because of this uh, opening in this, in this pouch. But uh, one thing that probably, if you do use it as a coin pouch, is the trick is not to open it all the way. So let me just close it just to give you a little example. If you open it like this and your hand kind of goes, your hand probably won't be compelled to go all the way because it's just like past that point. But if you open it all the way, you'll see that there is no opening. You'll see the zipper, like I can see the zipper right there. So that's, that's the rest of the zipper, but there is no opening. So if you just open it up to here, or maybe if you open it, I would say, you know, you kind of have plenty of slack without having coins falling out. See, even there, you, you might not lose anything. So up to here, so this much zipper can remain closed. And that way, if you do use it as a coin pouch, your coins would not fall out. So I would use it as a coin pouch personally myself, because I know when you're rushing, your, the tendency for me, I'm not gonna open this all the way because I'm just, I'm too lazy that way. So if I was just to like quickly open it up, my hand kind of stops there when I open it up. Yeah, you see, it's still, there's no opening. So you can use this as a coin uh, pouch. Just uh, remember not to open it up all the way. But like I said, since, since the zipper goes past the, the center, your hand really might not be that compelled to go all the way. It just might end, it just might stop there. So, but I like it. I mean, you can also use it for other things. It doesn't have to necessarily be coins. You can put your, like I'll put my scrunchie in here, maybe your headsets or rather your headphones. Um, just anything that you want to put in here, um, flat can work. So yeah, so that's cute. And like I said, you could just hang it off any of the, of the bags. So this is in the tiles teal, which I really love this pattern a lot. And, uh, and definitely this will be a keeper and I will most definitely use this on any of my other backpacks. I even have like solid, solid color uh, backpacks uh, with Vera Bradley. And I have my Ronnie and uh, my Dooney uh, and Burke Ronnie small uh, backpack and I will use this as well. I will have no problem hanging it on it. All right, so let's go to the swivel crossbody, which is what I'm really excited about. And this is a new uh, bag that came out from Lug not too long ago. I believe this came out in the beginning of August. And it is such a cute crossbody. I, I really love the, the shape to this. Of, it, of course, it reminds me of a, of a saddle bag, uh, definitely. Love the two zippers in the front. I love that pattern. Uh, it's just so pretty with the burst of these. Uh, it's almost like a mustard, Dijon mustard yellow uh, with a brown undertone. Uh, color to it and you have your pops of course of orange so you got your orange your yellows on this beautiful uh, tealish dark tealish uh, background and the two zippers love the zipper this is actually relatively new as well but yes but before I even go to the zipper I'm gonna note the size of this uh, cutie and it is not small and it's not big it's like a perfect Goldilocks size for a a crossbody. So yeah, so starting off with the zipper, as you see, there's two zippers in the front, and I, as always, love these lug zippers. They are the smoothest, most comfortable, uh, easy free zippers in the world. And now this lug zipper pull is different. It's it's a flat one, and it does say lug. And this is new actually. This little um, material. Uh, that they added at the end as a zipper pull. So that's cute. That's uh, I like that little addition to the bag. You got the lug uh, uh, plate right in the middle. So it's that little metal one. And uh, yeah, so it has two pockets and you have this one pocket. Um, it's sort of like a kangaroo pocket. Let me just open both and they just open, see again. It's just a easy, easy breezy zipper. 
Now, they have two pockets. Oh, I see. Okay, so this pocket, which would be on your uh, left-hand side, this one goes all the way to here. So that pocket is a big one. This one goes, yeah, halfway. Actually comes up to, up to right here. And they overlap each other. So with my two hands inside, I'm actually, it's like, it's like if my hands are like this. So that's how the, the pocket is in the inside. Which is really good because you have you do have the separation. Uh, not everything's gonna fall into each other. So you can put your phone on one if you wanted to, or you know, anything that you wanted to put here, your keys, it's not gonna it's not gonna touch whatever you put in here. Now, that is a really pretty pattern inside as well. I love that green. So the, I love the pattern um, that they use to complement the outside pattern. Uh, yeah, so this are these are your two front zippers, and then the back side. The back side does have the slip-in pocket, which is uh, like a lug uh, trait or trademark. If you ask me, it's a it's a you'll find it in a lot of almost all of their bags and travel items. They have these little uh, magnetic slip-in pockets that are felt line and. Let me just show you. See, so it's a felt line material, and this is where you will pretty much put your your cell phone, and that way you keep it protected from being scratched. It is a perfect uh, cell phone pocket. It definitely fits my cell phone with no problem. So, I have a Samsung 10 Plus. So anything Samsung 10 Plus that kind of size, it will fit in there, uh, definitely with no problem. And hopefully, I'll do a, a soon a what's in my bag. And then the inside, let me just show you the inside, let me just show you the zipper and the top. Again, pretty zipper, has a zipper pull with the material, and it has lug. And then we're just gonna open this up, and this is what the inside looks like, right there. Now every, every lug bag always has a, 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 a tag that'll put the name of the item, so in case you are wondering after years pass, well then you know this is the lug swivel. And let me just take out all this paper in here. Okay. Alright, so these are the straps. And the straps are, are another cool feature, but let me just show you the inside of the bag. Now the inside of the bag, you will see on one side of the wall you have this zipper compartment. And this is a fully covered zipper and it's a really nice uh, ample size to that zipper. And then in front you have this cinched uh, pocket, uh, slip-in pocket. Also it is felt line as well. So this one will be really nice if you want to put like maybe your reading glasses or sunglasses facing towards the felt lining. That would be nice and you don't have to worry about getting it scratched. And then this side has two um, loops for, for your pen. So two pen loop, loops as well you can put there. And then on this side of the wall, this is uh, pretty cool. Now this is a very long zipper. This one actually goes from this end all the way to the other end of the bag. So that is one very long zipper. And the reason they have it is because it shares two pockets. So this one zipper as you can see, it's stitched in the middle. She uh, has on one side this clear pocket, and then on this side has this pocket that is uh, lined uh, as a uh, uh, pocket. So that is pretty cool. I like that. So yeah, and I like the clear pocket because sometimes you want to see what you have. Well, then you can have that clear pocket to use. Very, very pretty. And that's the inside of the uh, bag itself. Love that lining. Uh, and then another cool feature about this bag, um, if you look at the profile, it has, of course, you know, you'll see the, the zipper that goes all the way around. So the bag, when it's zipped, has a very slender profile. So with the bag closed, you can still put plenty of stuff in here. Actually, let me just get a very big size wallet just to see. I am going to use this, um, split extra large that I have. I believe this is in amber olive. 
and let me just put that in there with the back clothes just to see yeah so it's gonna be a tight a tight fit but it does but it does fit so if you just wanted to carry say your wallet and maybe one other thing like a key then yeah that that could fit and you can still keep that slender profile now if you still want to carry this and you need more room the beauty of this bag is that it does expand into it goes from a one inch gusset to I believe a three or four inch gusset let me just show you how big a really sizable uh, depth now 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 you have a much wider bag I believe this is four inches so you could definitely now fit more stuff inside your bag and notice let me just remove this salt packet notice how the wallet fits much more comfortably now and you have a lot more room to put uh, say like a makeup bag um, your keys your phone well not your phone because your phone would be back here uh, so yeah so that is a really nice added uh, touch to this to the construction of this bag to the to the uh, makeup of this bag so that fits nicely and like I said this is an extra large uh, split extra large so if you have something smaller like the uh, split let me just find the split yeah so if you have like the split this is the split and put it in the bag fully open you have plenty of room I mean, you can even put the wallet like this and that is plenty of room to put a lot more stuff in there so yeah that is pretty and then if I zipper this up let's zipper the the bag back to its slender profile and it's so easy see how easy that is and you put your split wallets in here yeah see it fits fine you still have plenty of room as well to put other little things in there and it's, it would be just a nice a nice carry to this bag so that I really really like and if you have maybe something not necessarily the split but say you have something like a like this Vera Bradley this trifold wallet which is a, you know typical design for most uh, most wallets in in trifold fashion then again it has a nice fit in there as well even if you stand it up that could work you have plenty of room to zipper the bag and you have plenty of room to put stuff inside and of course if you undo the bag let's undo the bag open it up again and now you have even of course as you can imagine way more room to put a lot of stuff in there so yeah so this is a really nice bag I know I'm gonna get a lot of use out of this one love that pattern I can't even stop saying how pretty that pattern is but it's so pretty and uh, yeah so that is such a, a cool feature about this bag I really really like it and I do love that saddle saddle shape um, as you know saddle saddle shaped bags and saddle bags have been around forever again like my satchels I think saddles are saddle style bags are timeless they're never going to go out of style like the shape will always be around in some form or fashion so yeah so it's a cutie and then let me just show you also getting to the straps which what I'm gonna do is let me just cut all these little things out if I can all right so we're gonna remove all this sticker stuff this is usually what comes with the bag and there it is this is called the uh, swivel tiles teal and let's cut this off okay and there you go now let's remove this and you'll see that this has two straps so this reminds me like my Carson in uh, the Viva Barely uh, Carson bag where you have two straps it's the same fashion and manner so there are two straps to this bag oh and let me just show you first off this gorgeous huge round gunmetal ring that they they incorporated in the bag I love that I love the way that looks 
it just gives it a whole different look. I mean, you can put this inside, but look, yeah, see? That is so pretty. I just love that. It's so different and so cute. Now, it's not, it, it is not detachable. They have it like, sort of it looks like nailed on. Yeah, they put these little nails, little small nails on, on it. But uh, yeah, but it's just a beautiful gunmetal color. And Amy, you know, Lug uses the uh, heart, the uh, gunmetal hardware on all their bags. And that is so pretty. So yeah, so it is, they're both detachable. And, be and actually before I detach them, let me just show you one strap. Now this one is the shorter strap. This one is not adjustable. It is a short strap. It's meant to be used if you want to use it strictly as a shoulder uh, bag. That is uh, what it's made for. And let me just attach it and let me just show you. Yeah, so this would be strictly for um, a shoulder. So it's a nice drop. I would say it's probably about, uh, let me see, I would say maybe about a nine inch, 10 inch drop off the shoulder. Of course, I'll put some uh, my pictures in there, in here as well so you can see. But yeah, so that's, that's what it will look like. And if you just wanted to use it with that one strap, that's perfect. And then this one is the longer strap. As you can see, it has the lug name on it. It is completely adjustable, so you can just adjust it to exactly where you want it to go. And right now it's at probably, yeah, it's probably at its shortest right now. And if I attach it to this end, so this beautiful big round, big round ring, and that's what it looks like uh, attached there. So you can carry, I mean, I, I would personally carry the bag with both straps. I always love that look. That's just me, but there are, there are gals out there that they, they just like, you know, at Dick Denise's, I like only one, uh, one strap. So you can use whichever one makes you happy that day. You could use this one. This one has a nice, uh, the longer one has a nice, uh, shoulder strap uh, rather shoulder drop as well so I can use this one shoulder and I can use it of course as uh, as a crossbody because it's long enough to be made to be used as a crossbody or if you're basically wanting to use the short one and say you want it closer to under your armpit you feel more secure that way then this is a this is really perfect as well so I like both of them my my choice is going to to decide which strap if I had to pick one it's going to be really really hard but I think I can manage <laughs> somehow so yeah so it, it's just a really really pretty bag I love I love this pattern and I really love that it came with the with the, this uh, heart pouch to go with it as well yeah heart pouch to go with it and um, just to show you if you put it on the bag let me show you this is what it's gonna look like yeah so if you're gonna hang it it's gonna look like that now, I don't know if I would want to hang it like that I mean it's up to you it's your preference I think it's a cute little hang as well but um, I don't know if it would be too much for me but it's it looks really cute inside as well and if I threw it in the bag I think it is a pretty pretty compliment to have inside this uh, swivel yeah so that is my uh, swivel crossbody that I picked up from QVC and it's a really I really like this bag a lot a lot I do love the um, actually the pattern is uh, another thing with the stitching uh, they kind of made it it's like a whole different shape so it's not a diamond shape it's sort of like I would say like a chevron well it's not chevron well I don't know it has it's like a broken chevron kind of stitching to it so it has the stitching that goes from here to here so it's these little shapes and then they just continue the same shape across so it gives you that uh, sort of like a basket weave kind of look to it and it's only in the front on the side you have the uh, soft 
the smooth nylon and notice how it says lug right there cute and smooth nylon and the back is a smooth nylon as well and then it has some some of the heart some of the uh, the flower burst have lug so it has it here yeah this one is upside down <laughs> but anyway yeah so this is cute so like I said I couldn't decide if I wanted um, two other patterns and colors that I got so I picked them up just to have to see so this one definitely is going to be a Let's open up the other one and see uh, if I am going to keep this one and this is also a swivel same thing I couldn't decide like I said that day so I said well let me lock into at least uh, the, the, the price because if not I can always just return it back and this one let's move the receipt and this one oh I'm liking this one too I get a feeling I might be keeping this one as well this one is in the color copper oh I like copper copper is really pretty I don't own anything in copper as you can imagine so copper is pretty oh I love that color yeah see and you can notice now the pattern work uh, detail on that so that's really pretty oh yeah copper is very pretty let me see what copper looks like inside oh my goodness look at that it is like a confetti show in there yeah I did get a feeling I'll be keeping uh, copper but that is just so cute and notice how I opened the zipper just to give you an idea see I didn't open it all the way and it just kind of stopped right there for me I guess it's how your hand is kind of trained and yeah and no no opening but yeah this is so cute I like copper a lot and let's uh, check out uh, the swivel I get a feeling I'll be keeping because if I'm wearing something with pattern I think it's really pretty to to uh, have a solid color so yeah this is really a very pretty color this copper it is it's exactly copperish and I actually have a coat like in this color so it's gonna be a perfect perfect fit and look at all that confetti inside that is so pretty let's open the uh, the top the inside and this is what the inside looks like and more more confetti inside there yeah this is really adorable so yeah so I'll be keeping the the copper color this one I do like a lot this will look nice like with my my black duster sweaters that I have I think it'll look really really cute and maybe my uh, my sketcher boots that I have in brown color it's gonna look really really nice yeah so this this the, this is gonna be a keeper so that I'm I'm gonna keep I'll just leave this here so you can look at it I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep this one but like I said no foul and bind it and then returning or or maybe I'll resell it this one is uh, oh, this one is so cute too these are for my all my uh, feline addictionistas out there this is adorable and this one is called cat's orchid and it's exactly that all these cute little cats and the reason I picked this one up as well is because I love you know me I love my burgundy and wine color uh, background so this is a beautiful uh, it looks a little lighter but it's much darker um, a dark wine dark burgundy color but look how pretty that is Oh, look at all the little cute little kitties and the kitties are like they're almost like camo cats uh, I guess that's why they call it why do they call this cats orchid yeah but they look more like camouflage because they have these little I guess they're little spots on cats and then the inside to cats orchid is and this is cute inside you have the solid color with uh, these dots and notice this one little sneaky cat right there so there's a, a little cat in this one inside oh that is so cute and then it has the it says lug and really uh, this is like a really nice I would say salmon color 
um, interior with the with that one little sneaky cat. That is so cute. So yeah, let's look at the swivel bag and see if I'm gonna keep or sell or return one or the other. But this is the swivel bag. And this is really, wow, this is cuter than I, I imagined it was going to be. Because I'm a doggy person at heart. But, I mean, of course, I love felines and I love cats. I grew up, actually, with a Siamese cat, which uh, I think about every day, <laughs> actually. He's a, he was a cutie. But, yeah, so these have really cute cat silhouettes. Every single one is a real, actually adorable in this bag. So this is really pretty color. And you got more kitties in the back and then again my favorite zipper and let's look at all the inside what it looks like and the inside is adorable yeah that's that's really pretty so inside it has the same salmon color and then it has these little kitties uh, all throughout the bag so you got a kitty here Got some upside down kitties, and then you got kitties in here. Let me just, yeah, there's more kitties, and then kitties on the bottom. So, this is cute. So, yeah, so this one, like I said, is called the uh, Cat's Orchid in, in, the, in the swivel. All right, so that is my little swivel uh, haul of all my bags gonna put them all here so that you can look at it one more time with the different patterns and yeah they're all pretty and adorable so I do like and uh, yeah so um, I do hope that you enjoy my little uh, show my unbagging of lug and the the swivel bag and uh, like I said you can pick it up on QVC and you could go on lugs website as of now I believe they're having a, a, a sale so hopefully you'll be able to pick it up at a, at a really good uh, uh, price. Uh, I think it normally goes for, I really can't, I can't even remember off the top of my head, but of course I'll note the, uh, the original price, uh, what, what it retails for the, the swivel and the pouch. All right, Dick Denise, so thank you so much for joining me, for hanging now and sharing uh, this unbagging with me. Really appreciate it. If you like the channel, I, like I always say, give a thumbs up, or if not, give a thumbs down. <laughs> but uh, yeah, um, thank you for visiting and stopping by. Um, and uh, of course, I will check you out on the next one. So until then, stay safe, be well, love one another, keep those hand sanitized, and, um, and the mask and all that good stuff. And uh, I'll check you out soon on the next one. Take care now. Bye.